What's up, you guys? It's Susan Morad, right back here with Clever News. And Shane Dawson made a rare appearance in fiancé Rylan Adams' latest vlog, where he said his career is over, which then sparked backlash from former fans who fear he's attempting to gain sympathy. It's been almost eight months since Shane Dawson admitted to his past problematic behavior in his Taking Accountability YouTube video, but when making a rare appearance in his fiancé Rylan Adams' vlog, fans are waving the red flag over what they think could be a slow attempt at making a comeback. Back. In case you need a refresher, Shane was cancelled by fans last June after evidence surfaced of past racist and inappropriate behaviour, which caused his entire YouTube empire to take a tumble, a loss of brand deals and ads to be pulled from his vlogs. We're not going to get into all those details right now, but we'll link a video right here with a full breakdown if you're interested in more details. Anyway, Shane has been making sporadic appearances online over the past few months, more recently last Friday in Ryland's Extreme Horror Room Makeover vlog where the two are shopping at a furniture store together. The two then come across a giant red horse to which Shane attempts to make a joke about his career, which didn't exactly sit well with many fans. I know that I'm weird and I know that my career's over and I know that I'm just that crazy guy who buys weird toys. <laughs> As you would be aware, Shane has previously built a career on humor and self-deprecation, so this wouldn't have come too far out of left field had his old fans not shared their views that they suspect he's attempting at making a comeback based on sympathy. That said, his comment about his career left a sour taste in the mouths of many who took to social media to share their thoughts on the matter. One user tweeted, Maybe it's just me, but this feels extremely manipulative. I can picture him writing out these pity talking points and then writing a list of possible responses that he thinks his words elicit from actual empathetic people. Another person said, Totally expected. Shane Dawson says his career is over to make people feel sorry for him. And another tweet read, You know what's funny? It's the fact he's really trying to play the empath role for sympathy. Like his whole voice was just kind of as if he wants people to feel bad his career is over. Shane's latest appearance comes after a series of other instances fans have pointed out where they believe he attempts to gain sympathy as a means of easing his way back onto the scene. In November, a tearful Shane appeared on Ryland's podcast, The Sip, where he updated listeners that they had tragically lost their kitten Mario in a freak accident involving their dogs, less than a week after Ryland introduced him to the internet. Shane confessed during the episode, quote, Mario came when I needed him most and I needed to feel unconditional love and I needed to remember, like, I don't know, I don't want to get too much into the internet because it feels so stupid right now to get into that. All of Shane's appearances have been connected to Ryland, who hasn't stopped posting content, some of which, like their bedroom makeover back in September, directly involves Shane and his reaction. Based on the sentiment of many online, it seems unlikely Shane will be picking up his own channel anytime soon. To see what Ryland had to say around the time of Shane's cancellation, you can click right over here for another clever video. Then be sure to let me know all of your thoughts on Shane's appearance in Ryland's video down here in the comments. I'm your host, Susan Morad. I'll catch you later. Bye, guys.